Hey guys, this is Acer of Spades with Team ZLT. We are number one in state 268. Coming back to you on a hero day. Now this is a really, really cool day. I'm actually in the process of a double dip. Um, and again, guys, a double dip is simply a situation when your daily challenges line up back to back with your class of zones uh, so that you can maximize points and get chess. Now, right now, I'm on chess uh, number nine uh, over here for my Clash of Zones. This is my first time, so I'm recording. Actually, I'm probably going to title it um, First Time Getting Ninth Chess. Um, I'm going to have a really hard time, guys. This isn't easy, um, and I kind of blew it because I had a um, a little competition with my buddy Iggy. Uh, Shout-outs to Iggy over here at Team ZLT. He's absolutely crushing it. My boy Panda as well. I told him I'd give him a shout-out. Um, I had a competition saying that I would be able to beat him without using any Clash of Zone tickets. Now, I did say that I would record it, and I apologize because I really didn't get around to it. It was really late last night, um, but I kind of stumped my, my points. I would have easily blown past everybody. I actually ended up getting my first 41 million points um, without any use of any tickets whatsoever. I'm still in fourth place. No use of any tickets. Like That is strong. So I will, at one point, just for the viewers and just for the fans, I'll actually go ahead and do that and show you just how many points I can accumulate without having to uh, utilize any form of tickets. But obviously, the tickets are necessary in order for me to get my chest. So I'm going to scramble uh, in this last few moments to try to get myself up there. Um, at this current time, oh, look, Iggy's online. I'm going to actually, just for fun real quick, Iggy, you guys are being recorded right now. Please. Now, as you can see, he's wondering what exactly is going on. So anyway, kicked his butt. Uh, he, he knows all about it. Um, I guess my chat's dropping, whatever. Anyway, the whole point is now we are in that double dip situation. The daily challenge has started. Um, I'm rolling over from, okay, well, this is great. Let me go ahead. Here's exactly what I do. When all this happens, I close the app real quick. I go back to my game launcher. I allow it to reload. I'll have plenty of time. Luckily, things go really, really quickly. Okay, we're back. So I'm going to go ahead and do what we all call the uh, hero trick. It looks like we still have spin one wisdom medal gives you 2000. So I'm not getting points for a lot of things. But first things first, I need to get myself a few more heroes. So I'm going to go to recruit because I do get points for my tickets. I don't have any super recruits. And we're going to take it a little bit at a time, guys. We're just going to do a little bit at a time because, again, we don't get points on our... On our EXP or our hero. So we're going to do the bare minimum. Remember green only goes up to level 12. You unlock. Even though I don't get points for it. I do get points for the wisdom medals. Being spent to do it. Simply max out as we always talked about. Now understand guys. This is a whole lot easier. When you have a lower level base. I am base level 20. So unfortunately what that ends up doing. Is it puts you in a situation where everything is a little harder. Um, I found out that my actual bracket that I have to achieve is a whole million points more than if I was base level 19. So that is absolutely astronomical. Oh, look, Iggy says, I hope you tell me how you receive 75 million points with no tickets and only 900 wisdom medals. No, no. <laughs> only 41 million. Had to use tickets. My last chest. Doing it now. <laughs> All right, guys. He's interrupting me. Let's get past this. Um, back to my heroes. So I already have a few that have already leveled up. Now, part of this trick, and one of the most important parts, actually, is putting yourself in a situation where while you are getting uh, paid, as I like to call it, while you're getting paid, to level up your heroes when it says you get 10 points for every 
EXP. Um, that's when I level them up. Uh, typically, I try to have a few heroes already leveled up and ready to go. And then uh, at that point, I don't have to worry about anything. Okay, I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, uh, man, what's going on? Is it an internet thing? No big deal. Whole point is... Hold on, guys. Okay, and we're back. So, to make a long story short, I always check my city buff from my actual town base. And I have 13 minutes left, so I do have plenty of time. But still in all, as I was stating, I always try to have a couple heroes leveled up and ready to go. So that when I get ready to do this trick... I don't have to waste EXP. Now, unfortunately, it looks like based on the wisdom medals and stuff I have, I'm going to be held to a little bit of a halt very soon. But I'm going to try to get through this the best I can and get what I can get out of it. Now, what would be helpful is if some of these chests would offer me some wisdom medals, but you know they won't. See if I can't use a few of these tickets. Get me some more recruits. All right. Green is always gold, especially when you're low on metals. Because you don't have to level them up very high. Therefore, I feel like I'm not wasting a lot of EXP. And I can unlock two skills. And it lets me use a lot more wisdom metals all the way down to zero. I'm only at 1.5, guys. This is getting kind of tough. <laughs> Looks like I'm going to have to get myself some more medals. And I really don't like exchanging outside of my time. I have seven exchanges left. And I won't get any points for it. So, sometimes you have to learn when to call it quits. It is not a good idea knowing that I'm not going to max out. So I will wait for the following hour when I do get paid to level up my heroes. And I do get paid to... What do you call it? Do my exchanges. And then I'll do some exchanges so that I can get more wisdom medals, which will in turn allow me to hit another chest. Meanwhile, this is an important note, and I'm glad I'm making this video at this point because this is... Exactly what I do. I'll actually put fail um, inside the uh, caption in the title so that you guys know what not to do. Understand that I know just based on the math and the lack of heroes that if I'm going to uh, successfully complete this trick, I'm not going to get another 2.2 million points. Not just off of spending wisdom medals and super and super recruitment tickets that I don't have. So you got to stop. You have to assess the situation. Now, just so we feel we're clear, on the next possible double dip, I'll use another 50% ticket. I'll have more wisdom medals because I'm going to do some exchanges. And you only want to do them when they count the most, guys. This is the most important thing. Therefore, I need you guys to like, subscribe, comment. If you have any questions or concerns, let me know. I would like to make a video about it. More importantly, if there's something I missed or something that you can even suggest for me to do, Please let me know, guys. I want to grow just as much as you do. But what I've nicked and what I've mastered is another level. So, guys, please stay tuned. I'm going to show you my growth. I'm going to show you how to play this game the right way. And, uh, yeah, like, subscribe. Talk to you guys soon.